We're gonna get into Nintendo. Nintendo. My personal favorite out of all of these. Yes. Um, so Nintendo starts with my favorite man in the whole world, Giant Hands Reggie. <laughs> he comes out of this CG background. He's on the beach, motherfucker. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah, he is. He's on the fucking beach I'm talking about Nintendo the beach. beach. So Let me scoop this sand. He's just there, like, just, you know, reading off a prompter with this fucking green screen CG background. And, uh, then they cut to uh, Xenoblade Chronicles 2, which looks fucking amazing. Um, I wish I had time for RPGs like that. I just fucking don't anymore. Play Nino Kuni. You know, that's what I was surprised Sony didn't have at their end of their booths. Yeah, they did not talk about Nino Kuni 2. Unless it's a video that I missed, I didn't see it. I don't think I saw anything on there either. Um, so yeah, they had Xeno Chronicles 2. I knew that was coming. So that wasn't that big of a surprise. After that, though, they had a Kirby game. Yeah. Did I that? did not know it was coming. I didn't know either, but that looked really It looked really fucking good, cool. but they just called it Kirby. I think it's just a working title. They did that with a lot of things. Yeah, they A couple did. different things. Yeah. Um... After they shown the Kirby game, which looked, again, looked really cool, they then said that they're in the works of creating a core Pokemon game for, for the, the Switch, Switch, which I think is a brilliant fucking idea. It's a portable home console. Put a fucking Pokemon game on there. That'd be Absolutely. fucking amazing. Um, then after that, we saw the logo for Metroid Prime 4. I'm pretty excited about I mean, that. Like I said, I wasn't like the biggest five. Metroid fan, but I might check it out. For the prompt for uh, Switch, just because it might have made it a little bit better, you know, to what I might want to play. It's, it's gonna be Metroid Prime, which honestly I didn't care for two on the Wii as much because I don't like the fucking motion controls, which is kind of why I didn't go through three. Mm -hmm. But it, I, I really love fucking Metroid Prime. It has the same amount of exploration that you get in the two D ones, except you're in a three D world. Yeah. Then they had a Yoshi game. Mm -hmm. It looked like Paper Mario. <clears throat> look, also yeah. just kind of... Well, it looked kind of Paper Mario with like the yarn Yoshi. With Wooly World yeah. type mix to it. Um, yeah, I mean, it looked cool. It looked like it was doing a thing where it's like 3D, 2D kind of thing where you're going into the background and coming back out from yeah. stuff. And yeah, it, it looked cool. And right now I think that's just Yoshi, I think, is the working title on it. Yeah. But hey... It's good to see another Yoshi game in development. Like, there's a lot of really good stuff coming to the Switch, which I'm glad to see. Yep. Uh, then they had Fire Emblem Warriors. Mm -hmm. Looks interesting. I haven't played a Fire Emblem game in a long fucking time. Yeah, it's going to be Hyrule Warriors, but with Fire Emblem characters. Yeah. Which, and I, I like fucking Hyrule Warriors. Yeah, Hyrule Warriors is fucking great. Uh, then they talked about the Zelda items in Skyrim. Yeah. I already went over that previous. Uh, then they went through the Breath of the Wild DLC showcase. Mm -hmm. And they announced the second Brother Wild. You can get both of them for 20 fucking bucks. Yes. The, the second one looks like it's going to be balls of the walls insanity. Because they have the master uh, master difficulty, where it throws in golden lionels and like all the all these other super tough fucking regular world enemies. And it, it looks fucking great. And I think you learn a little bit more about, about all the, the champions. Uh, champions. So, well, about the champions. Which they're the also going to make amiibos for, which look Oh my god, great. those amiibos look fucking they good. They look fantastic. I'm so, it's so sad, but like, I don't normally buy this kind of stuff, but the amiibos, yeah. they, they look good. And they're, they didn't mention it there. They that Urbosa. Yeah. They didn't mention it at this thing, but there are three other Link based ones coming out uh, a Majora's Mask one, a uh, Skyward Sword, mm -hmm. and. Uh, <sighs> Oh, Stay away from my money. There's another Zelda one. I can't remember which game it's going to be. Wind Waker? Me. Yeah, there's like two oh, well, Wind yeah, Waker yeah, ones. Okay. Um, I don't know. There's another one. I can't remember. Link's exactly Awakening. Which. Yep, Marin. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, they they shown what the uh, the trial was going to be that you are going to give the Master Sword get, up and then you have to go through a trial. fucking naked as shit and just yep. murder the hell out of all shit to the enemies. Kill some shit. Yep. So, it, it looks sleep. really cool. They've shown uh, the other armors that are going to be in it. The, there's gonna yeah, be, the fucking Phantom armor looks too damn good. Yeah. Then you also have Majora's Mask is going to be in the game. You have Midna's Helm. A few shadows. 
Yeah, and then there was one, a, co a Korok mask, which helps which you find Korok. Find Koroks. Koroks. So you don't have to cheat yeah. by going online like a cheater. I don't do that shit. <laughs> but anyhow, so yeah, there was the, the Breath of the Wild showcase. I, uh, I think the first DLC is June 30th. So I gotta get that shit now. Because <laughs> I want to get gonna that sell out. ass shit. And then they talked about the tournaments that they were having. Uh, they, they were having a Splatoon 2, a Pokin... Pokin tournament. Pokin yes. tournament, yep, and an ARMS tournament. Which, ARMS looks fun as shit, too. I want to get that. Uh, talked about Mario Rabbids again a little bit. <laughs> we all know how we feel about that a yeah. little. And then they brought up uh, Rocket League. Yeah, the Coming Switch. to the Switch, and it's also going to be cross-platform. And oh. Sony's still like, nah, nah. We have to think about the children that play our console. We don't want them interacting with Nintendo. Or Xbox, that's bad for them. Yeah. Sony, yeah. sometimes, like, I love you, but I also fucking hate you really bad sometimes. Like, if, Ninten if Nintendo of all people can go up to Microsoft and be like, okay, yeah, fine, we'll do this one thing with you. Stay the fuck away elsewise. <laughs> just, just, let I know you two are like the two juggernauts, and it's like, oh, you shouldn't come to terms, but it's like, at one point, Burger King was even making McDonald's fucking items at their restaurant. Think about that shit. Just let people cross platform play. Just it fucking do it. Your numbers at all. I never understood why. Yeah. Because Sony doesn't want it to happen. Microsoft was all about it because they were like, we we we're doing it on a console, we're doing it with PC. Nintendo just said yes, fuck yeah. We got to talk to Sony. Sony's out there with shotgun. Bad the other way. <laughs> Yeah, it's like a zombie survival situation. Go up the bell tower like, Get back, you spawns of hell. <laughs> <laughs> and then they gave a release date then for Mario Odyssey. 10th the, of the Mario Odyssey trailer is ridiculous because he's just stealing the bodies oh, of yeah. fucking well, yeah, people. I was getting there. <laughs> yeah, we need to talk yeah. about that. It starts with a T-Rex running in. I'm like, oh, here's them talking about the Monster, Monster Hunter. Hunter. And it's just see this, this fucking hat Mario flies. hat. Lands on the T-Rex, and it's just like, wait, did he just become a fucking T-Rex? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, yeah. Mario's yeah. some kind of poltergeist or <laughs> some people Basically, shit? the idea, for people that don't know, uh, Bowser is, again, having Peach. He's taking her to get, get, to get married, and he's getting a bunch of wedding planners that are fucking evil as shit, and Mario gets this hat that gives him the power to possess things, so it's like a ghost. So, Mario's no longer just capturing fucking kingdoms he's possessing actual people like when he's in New Dunk City and he like steals that guy's fucking body I'm like dude you need to stop Mario you can't just this guy was probably going to work you ruined like, his life we're the fucking cops <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mario did you just enter that man <laughs> oh no <laughs> but I don't also like sensual entering he can also take the like in the form of like anything that mm. doesn't have a soul, it's like weird as shit. Bullet bills, goombas, shells, yeah. don't fucking matter. He just takes like it. He's a fucking <laughs> god now. When I, watched, when I watched this trailer, I was like half falling asleep, like watching it on my phone in bed, and I'm like, is this fucking happening? <laughs> what the hell? He's a goddamn demon, man. Yeah. It looks fun as shit. And I was geeking the fuck out when he had a fucking sombrero and the goddamn poncho thing. Yes. yes. You know, actually, uh, I like, saw a couple shit. articles. No, he's apparently they what they're doing is putting him in a lot of outfits that he's been in in other things like t the TV show, other games. Hmm. Because he's when was ever in a Mexican getup? I don't remember where I fucking seen the clip from, but it was some looking other, like one of the three caballeros going. <laughs> <laughs> it was some other game, and he's also in like a suit and tie, like he's a fucking mobster, like he was inside the Super Mario Super Show. Yeah, uh, that was hot as shit. It was a great suit. Then he also had his wedding get up. Yeah. Bush, by the way, those amiibos look good as fuck, man. Oh, yeah, there was amiibos for that, With too. A blast off all over Bowser. Wedding, whoa. Wedding Bowser, wedding Peach, and wedding Bowser Mario. Bowser in a pimp suit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know damn well people are going to be buying the wedding Mario and Peach to put on top of their wedding cakes. Oh, you already know Why gonna not? Happen. They're going to ruin that fucking amiibo oh, real Hell quick. yeah, that, MC, that MFC tag ain't going to reach shit in there after <laughs> that cake. Was that frosting? Delicious. Buttercream just takes all that data right out of it.